welcome guys uh, i hope you are enjoying my lectures uh, now we will discuss here transformer basics uh, i will tell you the transformer basic from very basic level okay uh, transformers are electrical devices consisting of two or more coils of wire used to transfer electrical energy by mean of changing magnetic field so in the picture uh, you can see here this is the coil okay this is coil number 1 this is coil number 2 this is a load which is a basically bulb here you can see this is a alternating sign which is a generator IP here you can see the primary current VP is you can see the uh, primary voltages and P and here it is number of turns there are how many turns IS is secondary current VS is secondary voltages and S is basically secondary turns QM is the magnetic field uh, this square box shape this is basically an iron core so we will discuss later so what's the uh, in detail about the transformer structure but here you can see uh, there is a generator connected or voltage source is connected here if there is a voltage coil has its reactance so some current will flow here again the magnetic field will be produced it will induce voltages at the secondary side the flux will cut this basically conductor copper conductors EMF will be induced and this EMF again will basically produce the voltages potential difference at secondary side if there are more number of runs the voltages will be more if there are less number of runs the voltage will be less so then it will drive the current at secondary side and this current by this uh, light bulb will be uh, lit so this is basically the very simple transformer structure uh, let's discuss more a transformer basically is a very simple static stationary electromagnetic passive electrical device that work on principle of Faraday's law of induction by converting electrical energy from one value electrical voltages from one value to another so this is a uh, uh, first of all Transformer is a stationary device. There is no moving part in transformer itself in, as, a, as, a, as a functionality. Secondly, in transformer, uh, is word is coming from transform. So, what it is transforming? What it is changing basically? Is it changing energy at side? At, uh, at a lab, for example, a transformer is converting 11 kV to 132 kV. There is more energy at secondary side. If it is boosting the voltages up from 11 to 132 kV. The answer is no. Energy will remain same. Uh, it's not doing anything with energy. There is a law of conservation of energy uh, that you should know. The energy can neither be created nor be destroyed, but it can change its forms. So here the form will remain electrical, while the voltage level surely it will increase or decrease. Second point: transformer does this by linking together two or more electrical circuits using a common oscillating magnetic circuit which is produced by the transformer itself a transformer operates on the principle of electromagnetic induction in the form of mutual induction as we have seen primary coil will produce the magnetic flux secondary coil will be cut by this magnetic flux and it is of some kind of mutual induction so basis on the principle of mutual induction the transformer will work Mutual induction is a process by which a coil of wire magnetically induces a voltage into another coil located in close proximity. So, uh, what are the questions? Question is here why we have used or uh, why we are using magnetic uh, iron? Why you are using iron? Why not using air in the transformers? So, ask yourself if we have a power transformer. If you remove the flux can also flow through trans, uh, through air. So if you remove the core, iron core, what will happen? So this is your the question asking from you. So just uh, think, uh, try to find some answers. We will come back in the next lecture. Thank you.